today I am here at Curls One on One and I'm gonna get my curls diagnosed. I hope to better learn how to take care of my hair at home so I don't need a hairdresser. I'm curious as to what hair type I have because there's so much online about like 4A, 4B, 4C. I think I'm a 3C. What's like the proper way to really like diagnose your curl type? Usually when you don't have a lot of moisture in your hair, your curl shrinks a lot. So dehydrated equals tighter curls? Yes. And moisturized, moisturized means looser curls. looser curls. Wow. So what kind of curl do I have now? From what I'm seeing, I feel like you have between a 4C and a 4D, but in the same head of hair, you could have five different types of curls. Use warmer water instead of hot water. Using super hot water, it dries your hair more. I guess my biggest question is how can I maintain my moisture without necessarily having to wash it two or three times per week. You can just refresh your curls with a spray bottle and a okay. little bit condition of that. Okay. The first thing I like for curly hair, to use a sulfate-free shampoo. So what is sulfate? It's detergents. What it does is taking away your natural oils and it's drying your hair more. It's the same thing as our skin. When it gets drier, it gets more tighter. I never thought to compare hair to skin, but that makes sense. Like when your skin is dry, it's like tight, it's like tighter. you can't smile. So we're gonna do the no pull. Okay. But every time you wash your scalp with a no pull, mm -hmm. always massage your scalp. Okay. The Build Up Buster, it's a deep cleansing serum. So it removes whatever buildup you have in there. It brings your curls back to life and removes everything that shouldn't be there. Now we're gonna jump to the conditioner. Start it from the ends and you work your way up. It's really easy for you to detangle now because you detangled with the cleanser first. Yes. And when you work with the conditioner, I want you to work in small sections. Mm -hmm. So instead of like just ripping your hair through like this to detangle, I want you to start massaging it. Then you could run your fingers through and start detangling. But make sure you start all the way from your roots. You don't need a comb. The best comb for your hair is your hands. Train yourself to do everything in the shower. Okay. Especially when you do wash and goes. Twist out, it needs to be out of the shower. Okay. But wash and goes, do it everything in the shower. When I'm conditioning it, how often should I be conditioning or deep conditioning my hair? Curly hair is always thirsty for moisture. So if you want to condition it as much as you can, please do so. And he takes really good care of his hair. So ladies, take notes. <laughs> Now, hair is washed. What should I be doing to make sure that the twist out looks good looks when I take it out? You can use a comb just so you can smooth them a little bit, okay. but it has to be super, super gentle. Okay. For my opinion, the less, the better. You don't need so many products to embrace your hair. What is gonna help you is the massaging in your hair and a lot of water. I just wanna show you how beautiful and to find your curls look after all the massage. Mm -hmm. You see how there's no frizz mm -hmm. at all? I'm massaging the most, doing the twist out, instead of like using the comb too much. Because when you massage it, you really get to make those products sit way better in the cuticle instead of just on top of the cuticle. When I detangle, I have quite a bit of shedding. A good amount of my hair comes out in the shower, which is like alarming sometimes. Is that normal? That's kind of pretty much normal. So you see how your hair is pretty much almost 90% mm -hmm. dry, right? So we're gonna use a dryer. You're mm -hmm. gonna use it exactly how it is. You're gonna need to use a diffuser because I want you to kind of like focus on your root, just dry your root out. If I were doing my twist out at home, would I think to sit under the dryer or could I just do it at night and just let it dry overnight? Most of the time when the girls do this, they do it overnight. Or if you have a dryer like that, you can sit under the dryer. Some girls, they really like to use some oil. I like the Miracle from Diva. If you wanna have a better control of the baby hair in the side, you can use a little bit of pomade. Oh my gosh, I'm always trying to control my baby hairs. So when you open the twist out, make sure you open them pretty gentle. I love it. I'm gonna place a few clips in her hair so we can give a little bit more lift. Helps your roots to dry quicker. I drive like this Do at you? work. <laughs> Curly hair is like the gentle you are with them, the better results you are going to get. Want to do this at home and be a little bit more quicker, you can use a diffuser. This is a Diva diffuser. You can just hold the diffuser around the hair without touching too much because you create more frizz. So halfway through drying, do that. Mm -hmm. And then instead of like keep touching it too much with your hands, you just flip your upside down and just give a good shake. I am super. 
excited about my twist out. I love it. I love how curly it is. My curls are way more defined than when I came in here. Nice. My transformation is done. Oh my gosh. You are the queen. So now you can pra start practicing this at home. Yeah. I'll say, I came in a little bit cocky, thinking like, I'm probably not gonna learn that many new things. <laughs> I mean, I learned a lot today. Before when I came in, we didn't know what my curl pattern was. What would you say it is now? To me, for sure, it seems like a 4A. Cool. Because you start seeing the definition. I normally just never do a twist out because number one, it takes a lot of time. And then when I take it out, I'm not always happy with the results. But I love that you showed me that I need to twist tighter. I feel like my twists are always so loose and they're even frizzy before I even get <laughs> to let it dry. Just making sure to keep my hair moisturized. I also learned that like my hair can be silky. I never put the word silky plus my curls together in one sentence. Thank you so much, Donatella. Oh, thank you. I feel thank like you, I've learned you. more in the last hour or so than I've learned in the five years that I've been natural. 